This afternoon, relative quiet at Ogilvy Transportation Center, the downtown hub for some of Metra's commuter trains. The few here noticing the addition of plexiglass kiosks near the Union Pacific train lines, a new step by UP to make sure passengers are paying their fair share. In March, all Metro lines stopped collecting cash fares temporarily, but in June, eight of Metro's 11 lines, those run by BNSF and Metro, started collecting cash fares again. The only holdouts were the three lines run by Union Pacific, North, Northwest, and West. It's been on the honor system for the most part, as UP conductors have not been walking the train cars to check tickets like they normally would be. UP told us they did not think it was safe for their conductors to interact with customers, and so they, since June, have not resumed what Metra and BNSF resumed. Metra estimates it's cost them about a million dollars a month in lost revenue, which they sorely need. Since COVID, ridership is down 90%. We would prefer that they resume uh, ticket collections uh, with conductors on the trains just like they were doing pre-COVID. They are still reluctant to do that, so they suggested this alternative method, which has started today. Which brings us back to those kiosks, the ones set up at the UP lines at Ogilvy. UP employees should be checking tickets now of passengers entering and exiting, but only here, not on board the trains or at any other of the 65 stations. In a statement to WGN, Union Pacific said in part, we continue to use an abundance of caution following the tragic loss of two employees during the pandemic. This new process to sell and verify tickets allows us to increase fare collection while protecting our employees and Chicago commuters. On my Metro, we're committed to your safety. It was just last month that Metro rolled out an ad campaign highlighting cleaning procedures to allay any fears. We think that because of the uh, protocols we've adopted, the steps we've taken, that it's safe to uh, ride and work on, on the trains.